I was born in Ottawa in 1891. In August 1914, uh, I enlisted uh, in Ottawa, went to Valcartre in uh, September 14, and uh, gradually was turned into a soldier and uh, got over to England about uh, in November and spent part of the winter on Salisbury Plains, went to France uh, in uh, the end of uh, January, and uh, had a tour in the trenches until um, the spring, when we were ordered from reserve into where the Germans had broken through with the first gas attack at Ypres. In the, in well, we, we had about two months in the trenches. What was that like? Describe that. Uh, but uh, the, uh, the big action, which was right in the open, because we had, uh, after the Germans had broken through, with, after putting forward the gas, we went in that night and kept on going in the dark until we could hit the Germans. And uh, the Canadian 1st Division, uh, we're given the credit of saving the situation at that time. And there I uh, almost ended my soldiering uh, because uh, I had a gunshot wound in the left shoulder. It entered there and went out more or less in the middle of my back, fortunately missing my shoulder blade and my spine. And that laid me up in hospital in England for about a year, so that uh, my experience in warfare was somewhat limited. But we, uh, the trenches were not comfortable, <laughs> and it's certainly uh, a surprise. You know, you never think you're going to be hit with a bullet, but when you're hit, you do know it. It was like being kicked with a horse. <laughs>